okay everyone uh, today we are going to talk about Grafana and Prometheus of course that uh, from Prometheus you couldn't save your data so when your data is gone or something happened with your parts or your Prometheus or your surface is gone or you might delete your Prometheus the data in your Prometheus is totally gone you will lose the data and you couldn't recover anymore and the second one I'm going to tell you that the Prometheus is that application that can store your data default is uh, 15 days however you can change through the uh, configuration file of the Prometheus itself if you may be afraid of with the data maybe your data will lose or you still need the data for more than 15 days first things that you can do is change the configuration of the files but today i'm not going to show you i will show you later and the second one uh, you might save the data but how okay let's we talk about how to save the data the first of all what you need is you need to install the primitive itself of course that permit is not only just a monitoring application but it is also uh, like database application so the uh, the the data that we scrape from our metric from uh, in this case is in nginx ingress controller or whatever data you want to scrap uh, in this case uh, and the first one you have to install the Prometheus the Prometheus itself basically is not only just uh, it's not just a monitoring application but also it's database application and the second one we install a like Grafana the Grafana here trying to uh, taking the resources or data resources I use a Prometheus so the data is basically coming from the Prometheus itself and then Grafana try to display the data from Prometheus and you can see the graph in your Grafana so these two combination of the monitoring tools can help you to uh, to review your performance of your machine so I've already run some uh, services or I have uh, run a request from the client and then got the result uh, about this okay this is my result so I have a 20 this the, the date that we have and also this is 12, 12 hours ago and this our data from Prometheus okay the Prometheus showing the data from itself and the database is from Prometheus itself we have the data for for today it's like uh, we have a, a 5th May a 5th June 2022 and then it's 30 minutes ago and we will do the same things like in the Grafana like we have data and then we are going to save the data from 30 minutes ago uh, when the last time we run so basically you couldn't install you couldn't save the, the data from the Prometheus I'm trying to find the way how to uh, save the data from Prometheus but I couldn't find it maybe if you know there's uh, the information you might tell me in the section uh, comment below but today I'm going we are going to do some modification and do some uh, uh, solution for our uh, problem through the uh, Grafana we are going to use uh, uh, Grafana to download the database from the uh, Prometheus itself so uh, you can see here this is my da uh, dashboard and I'm going to download all of the data here uh, nginx ingress controller you just press the share dashboard or panel you press it there is share link and snapshot and then you have to use a snapshot when there's snapshot there is time out here and you can change any time you want and the best one uh, the basic one is four minutes uh, four seconds i mean okay you go to local snapshot and then copy paste i uh, click it uh, click the link or you might copy paste or you 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 save the link of uh, the snapshot as we can see here uh, this one is original one uh, okay and this one is a uh, snapshot from the dashboard you can read it das, uh, dashboard and snapshot and you also have to make sure your data is safe well like and if not safe well you 
or maybe like uh, something bad happened because not or don't not all the pages what you need is changing the uh, snapshot a timeout you might increase it like a 10 or yeah it's not problem just leave it like 0 or 10 zero, like a 10 second or even 15 second or even more is uh, it's up to you as long as the data that you want to save is uh, how to say is completely downloaded okay and then let, let me copy paste again and then and then we try to run rerun again okay so this is work so and then the question is how if you lost your snapshot link if you lost snapshot link no problem the grafana still save the link for you go to grafana again and go to uh, snapshot this old database that you can see and you can find them in the last of your uh, lines i mean in the last of your snapshot snapshot you just click it and then this is a snapshot that we have so you can download and you can create a database from uh, this picture of course the first if you want to download the raw data of the picture and you want to maybe you want to import them to the excel file you can use uh, this button and then just pick whatever you like maybe you want to take a picture of this maybe you want to take uh, i mean you want to download data of the the average memory the network or anything you like and this the way you just click them and then you just uh, choose inspect and uh, choose data there is a uh, here data and this is really clear enough that the data that you can download from uh, with the uh, csv format or maybe json format this is up to you but basically because we are going to use uh, excel file we can download them through uh, with the CSV format okay yeah this is CSV format and you can open with uh, any application like LibreOffice or Microsoft Excel to to open your data okay uh, everyone I think that was I hope it was help and then it was clear for you and thank you very much.